Hi everyone. In this tutorial, we'll walk you through the main interfaces of the Smart Mic Plus app. So let's go. In the main interface, you can switch between two modes, audio and video recording mode. The first button on the bottom left is used to adjust the video aspect ratio, including the most commonly used ratios 16:9, 1, 1, and 4, 3. Let's take a look at the second button at the bottom. This is the audio setting interface and can switch between automatic mode and professional mode. In the automatic mode, we can choose to turn on off the built-in microphone of SmartMic Plus, any external microphones, and the mobile phone microphone. When switching to professional mode, additional options include setting the volume of the background music, the stereo left-right channel ratio, the noise reduction level, microphone gain, and monitoring volume. The third button at the bottom is the filter function, including several commonly used filters and smooth options. The fourth button in the lower right corner includes settings for shooting and your device. Here, you can choose to turn on the grid for video shooting, the resolution, bitrate, and frame rate of the video. For some mobile phones, the dual camera shooting function is also included here. In the device management screen, the firmware version of your smart mic will be displayed. An upgrade prompt will appear if your smart mic plus is not up to date. You can also customize the function of the power key and the indicator light. For example, here I can set the double click button to start and stop background music and here I can set the indicator light to breathing mode. Other experimental features can also be turned on here such as preview mode and hearing enhancement. In the upper left corner of the main interface, here you enter a list of all your recorded clips where you can browse, delete, or export. And in the upper right corner, you can switch between the front and rear camera. Now you know how to use the SmartMic Plus app interface. If you have any other questions, feel free to contact support at sabinetech.com. Thanks for watching.